When working the posterior leg, posterior lower leg, the tricep suri group, which is composed of the gastrocnemius medial and lateral heads and the deeper soleus, we have a choice that we can work this group with the knee joint basically in extension. I have a bit of a bolster here, so it's not pure extension, but it's close to full extension. And if we do this, we can get really nice work into the gastrocnemius. But if the gastrocnemius is tight, then it's likely that we're not going to penetrate as deep into the underlying soleus. If we want to get into the soleus, then we would need to slacken the gastrocnemius to allow penetration through it into the soleus. The gastrocnemius, in addition to crossing the ankle joint, also crosses the knee joint crosses the knee joint posteriorly. So the gastroc is a flexor of the leg at the knee joint. So if I bring her leg at the knee joint into flexion, then the gastrocnemius is slackened. And that means that I can penetrate through it deeper into the underlying, the deeper soleus muscle. And we can really get through gastrocnemius nicely this way and get right into that soleus and assess it if we find something tight, work there. So a general rule, whenever you have two muscles, muscle A, which is more superficial, and muscle B, which is deeper, if you want to penetrate through muscle A to get to muscle B, you need to slacken muscle A. In this case, the gastroc is more superficial. We slacken it with knee joint flexion. That allows us to get in to the deeper soleus. If you liked this video, know that it is part of our video streaming subscription service. Click the link below for more information and receive a free ebook when you sign up.